Hey y'all, this is Jamie. Welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, I am going to be doing a review and lip swatches for the Makeup Revolution Hydra Balm Lip Gloss. But before we get into that, make sure that you subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell so you can be notified when I upload a new video every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Give this a big thumbs up if you enjoy it. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get into it. So happy new year everyone. I hope you all had a wonderful holiday season um, and I hope everyone is ready for 2022. I know I am. I'm ready to just like get moving with things. So I am doing something like somewhat new. I'm going to do a lot more reviews on my channel. I would like to kind of turn this into more of a review channel. Um, definitely in regards to makeup. So with my reviews, I am going to be doing five minute reviews. So I know that as the years go by, our attention span goes down. Five minute reviews is what we are doing on this channel. If there is anything that you guys would like me to test out for you, definitely leave those in the comments down below. High end, drugstore, affordable, whatever. <laughs> Probably not luxury, y'all know. I'm in my parents' house at the age of 31. Okay, so let's be real. So that is gonna be your question for the day. What product would you like to see reviewed on this channel? So we're not gonna waste any time. We're on the clock, guys. Let's get to it. So in today's video, today's review is gonna be on the Hydro Bomb Lip Gloss from Makeup Revolution. Um, if you have not already seen, I do have a video doing a review and lip swatches for the Pout Bomb Plumping Lip Gloss. I did that a couple years ago. Um, I will link it up in the cards. Oh my gosh, it's been a long time since I've filmed. I don't know, I don't remember where it is, but I will link it. <laughs> similar packaging, um, similar looks. This is not considered a plumping lip gloss. So let's go ahead and talk about the details of this product, what it is, what are the benefits, what it's gonna do. So this is a high shine and non-sticky lip gloss. It contains peptides and hyaluronic acid for hydration and for plumping. It is vegan and cruelty free. This comes in six shades, all of which I have today and will be swatching for you. And it is $7. It is available to purchase at Ulta, as well as Makeup Revolution. It is not available at Target though. So Target does sell Makeup Revolution. This product is not there though. So those are all the product details. This is supposed to provide hydration with that hyaluronic acid. It's supposed to plump a little bit, um, but it's not technically considered a plumping lip gloss. I think that plump is just supposed to come from that hydration that is being provided to your lips. So let's go ahead and do the lip swatches. New year, new Jamie. I've got new. I've got notes for each video that I'm gonna be. I'm. Up, I'm keeping to this. No rambling, which I already kind of did. I, I went off script. Review time. So let's talk about pros and cons for each review video. I'm gonna have pros. I'm gonna have cons because I feel like there are typically both with any given product. Let's talk about the pros. So pro number one, it comes in clear. I love lip glosses that come with a clear shade. And I'm sorry, I'm like getting, I sometimes get red and like at random moments. I love when lip glosses come in clear because you can just use it for anything, for any given look, clear lip gloss is perfect. Pro number two, it is very hydrating and plumping. I Now I'm not gonna say plumping as in like, oh my gosh, I can feel it tingling and doing things to my lips. But I feel like, and I've said this in almost every lip gloss video that I've ever done, lip glosses just provide a natural plump effect to your lips. That's just the nature of lip glosses. They make your lips look like plump and juicy. I think it is because it provides that hydration and just makes your lips like 
living life to the fullest, really, these lips are. Pro number three, it smells really good. This smells like coconut. Another pro, they are not super sticky, so it did say that it is a non-sticky lip gloss, I would definitely say that it is a little bit. I feel like most lip glosses are, um, but it's not stringy. Pro number five, the shades are pretty. I actually really like all of the shades. I think all of them could be flattering on a lot of different skin tones. And finally, for the last pro, this one is something that could also be a con depending on the person and what your tastes are in lip gloss, uh, but they do have a really opaque color. So you get a lot of color payoff on your lips, and that could be a pro if that's what you want. It could also be a con if you know you don't necessarily want that if you just want like a little hint of a color um on your lips this probably is not the gloss for you so moving on to cons there is a noticeable bad taste to this lip gloss i don't always notice the taste of glosses but this one did have like a noticeable bad taste and that could be because of con number two it is like gloopy it's it's like gloopier than normal so that might be why i'm actually able to taste a little bit because it is like a little gloopy on my lips this also could lead to con number three which is that it is a little bit patchy it has kind of an uneven application um, and takes a little bit of mm, that kind of thing to get it to fully cover the lips and be kind of an even coloring throughout i especially noticed that with this last one the darkest shade which is stormy con number four is the shades aren't as varied so there, ha there are like these four shades right here are all pretty similar. They're like pretty similar, just nude lip glosses. Um, and I would definitely say that these shade three shades are pretty similar. If you're definitely just looking for one or two shades, the shades that they have are great. Get the clear gloss and then get one of the like more nude shades and I think you would be good to go. All right, so each of these review videos, I am going to give a score to the product. Because I love sunflowers so much, I am gonna give them sunflowers. So there is a possible five sunflowers to be had for each of these products. And for this one, I would give this four sunflowers. I was gonna give them a three and a half, but as I've been sitting here with this on my lips, which by the way, this is the third shade versus on my lips right now. As I've been sitting here, some of the things that I put in the con list have kind of disappeared a little bit, like the bad taste, um, the uneven kind of patchiness. It's, it's a little more even as I've been sitting here doing like this and talking a little bit more. So I did bump it up to four sunflowers. So four out of five sunflowers for the Hydro Bomb lip gloss from Makeup Revolution. All right, so that is it for today's video, for today's review. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't already, remember to subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell so you can be notified when I upload a new video every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. If you haven't already, go down into the comments and answer that question of the day. What is one product that you would like to see me review on this channel? Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye, y'all.